Alright, what's up guys? So, doing a second attempt on astrophotography. And let me see if I can hit this without shaking it so much. There it goes. Uh, did it go into astrophotography mode? I don't think so. I think when I shook it, it took it out of it. Okay, let's see. Um... Let me take it out of night sight and then put it back into night sight. See if it resets it and puts it in. There it goes. So I guess you can't really fiddle with this. Um, all right, there we go. About a minute four and counting. And I'm actually shooting this with the, um, the Pixel 3 this time. So the first shot will be done from the Pixel 3. Afterwards, uh, I'll switch it over to the Pixel 4 and see what we get and kind of just like mash it all up in one video. But uh, so far it's looking good. It's looking okay. Uh, waiting a little bit longer for a better photo it says. But it actually looks like it's going to do better with the Pixel 3. I'm seeing more stuff kind of appear. So we'll see how the photo comes out afterwards and I'm going to try one with the Pixel 4 see how that comes out. But um, I'm sitting out here with the lovely wife. Say hi, babe. Hi. <laughs> yeah, I decided to do it from my backyard. It's dark enough back here. Um, you guys might remember these, this area because this is where sometimes I vlogged outside. But yeah, um, no interference from those lights over there because that tree is doing a hell of a job blocking any light. All right, so let's see what we got here. Let me check here and I'll also post a photo too. Uh, looks like a little bit of lens flare. I'm not really seeing anything of the sorts. So, well, let's switch it up to the Pixel 4 and see what the Pixel 4 can do with uh, astrophotography. All right, so we switched off devices. We're using the Pixel 4 right now to get an astrophotography shot. It's gonna take about three minutes. Um, and I'm still here with my lovely wife sitting right there. She just tried out Night Sight on her Pixel 4a. Not astrophotography, but Night Sight and actually captured a really good photo of like the night sky with the stars actually showing in it. Um, we got like another two minutes and 40 seconds and counting. Said it's fine tuning the photos. I'm kind of, I don't know if you guys can see it, but I'm kind of seeing stars in the shot. Do you guys see that? So even though the Pixel 3 has the same camera sensor as the, as the, the Pixel 4, I'm thinking there's just a little bit of a difference here when it comes to it. Sorry for my shaky hands. I don't have a tripod. And I know the Pixel 3 video has this jello effect ever since the Android 11 update. But, man. Hey, where's your, where's your Pixel 4a, babe? Pull that photo up. I was actually looking pretty good. And with this shot, I did not even once like zoom in. Oh, um, put in portrait. Not portrait, uh, landscape, sorry. Just turn it. There you go. So that's just a night sight shot. That actually looks pretty good. I have to say, that looks really, really good. So, here you go, love. Anyways, so compare this photo and then I'll do a couple of more and maybe I'll mess with editing today to see what kind of shots I, I can create with the, the Google Photos editor see if I can spruce this up a little bit it says it's capturing more light but the viewfinder is showing all this stuff but I can see a little bit of stars there that's actually looking really good hopefully the, the photo comes out just as good as it's looking on the viewfinder I think this would be a nice photo to share so right now we're demoing the Pixel 4a and it's astrophotography seeing if uh what kind of results we get so she'll text me this photo afterwards and uh, see how it comes out huh it's actually not looking too bad the viewfinder what it shows then after that i'm gonna grab a little bit more there's a couple of stars straight up ahead so i'm gonna try to get it in a good shot and then I'll show you guys the raw photo and then I'll show you guys what the photos look like after being edited because I'm going to edit these photos to kind of show you guys what you guys can do with Google Photos, astrophotography, and the pixel cameras. So 
That's the whole point of this video. So we'll see what happens here. Check back in in a little bit and then close out this video.